Today, Winoka and I are out at Pine Lake at Wheaton Regional Park, and we are staring up in a tree at a majestic great blue heron who's standing on a branch no more than maybe 30 feet above the ground. Most people are walking by, never bothering to look up, never even noticing. Always a reminder that when you're out for a walk, you got to look up, you got to look down, not just straight ahead. We were hoping to capture some dramatic photographs of the bird flying across the pond and maybe even video. We've been standing here for maybe half an hour to an hour trying to capture that perfect image, always in search of more shots of our favorite bird. And the thing with nature is that you just never know. Sometimes you can go out and just walk right into a scene and get the most amazing shots and the most amazing experiences. And other times you're standing out here for hours, even when something amazing is in your line of sight, but not much happens. And that's part of the beauty of these experiences. A belted kingfisher darts across the pond. The beauty sometimes is just in the waiting, in the anticipation, in the excitement of what could happen. And in some ways, that excitement of what could happen just electrifies the moment. Kingfisher is coming back. And the anticipation builds. And we know that the moment we put the camera down, the moment we turn our backs, the heron will inevitably fly exactly to where we were just standing. So I keep the recording going, trying to get that minute so I can capture it and narrate it in live time. A couple of mallards hanging out in the middle of the pond. The kingfisher takes off again to go get a better angle. And Winoke is inching even closer to the heron. The heron's looking down, perhaps wondering why we're so fascinated with it. So the question remains, do I stop the recorder and turn off the video on my camera and walk away and risk missing the moment? Or do I just stand here until I can stand no more? That's the question we all have to ask when we're out in nature, in the woods, whether it's by Pine Lake in Wheaton Regional Park or anywhere else. Stay tuned for more, if more happens. But even if it doesn't, in a way, it already has.